If you had said to us six to eight weeks ago, would you take a quarter final against South Africa? Yeah, of course you would. And uh, it's something that we're looking forward to from a coaching perspective and a, and a playing perspective. And, uh, you know, injuries are part and parcel of the game. We've had our fair few, but uh, I think we keep on saying, you know, the players are available to us. Uh, we trust them uh, and they're giving us 100%. And, yeah, of course, there's going to be some mistakes uh, along the way. But, uh, you know, you back your players and uh, they'll give 100% as they've done for the last four or five weeks of the tournament. So we're looking forward to that opportunity. Yeah, we've called Eli up. Uh, he's not available this weekend uh, for selection. Uh, he's just got back uh, over the last injury which he had uh, when we released him. And uh, he'll be uh, available if needed uh, for the following week. Whenever you beat a side, it gives you uh, some confidence. Uh, we're well aware of that South African lineup. Uh, it was outside the IRB window. Uh, I think that, you know, having looked at South Africa over the last four or five weeks, I think, uh, you know, the Japan loss refocused uh, where they were at. And uh, in, my, in my experience and the, and the players' experience, every time we played South Africa, it's been a very physical and attritional and, comp and comprising game. And is going to be no different on Saturday. It's knockout football. Uh, I think that uh, you know they're probably one of the most experienced sides in Rugby World Cup. Uh, they've got you know a really solid, experienced front five. And when you look at threats, they've got all over the park. And uh, you know their centre partnership, uh, whilst you know very young, uh, you know they've come through the uh, under twenties uh, and they've played together. It's a combination which. Uh, they've got the ability to be physical and have uh, slight dexterity in, in their skills and uh, is something which we're very mindful of.